Train service tonight is stopped between San Diego and Orange counties and anywhere north of there. You should know a bluff collapse in San Clemente has stopped that service indefinitely. A landslide damaged part of the Casa Romantica Cultural Center, sending dirt and debris down that hillside yesterday. You can see the visuals right there. Tonight, crews are working to stabilize the coastline. Good evening. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Marcella Lee. This closure affects thousands of passengers. The damage caused Metrolink to shut down rail service south of Laguna Niguel. Amtrak officials say service Services stopped south of Irvine, leaving San Diegans without a way to get north by train. Now, this stretch of tracks out of San Diego just reopened after six months offline. And tonight, some experts say we are fighting a losing battle against nature. CBS 8's Kirsten Holmes has the latest. We're here in Del Mar. If you take a look behind me, you can see some tracks. These tracks lead to the area in question where the landslide took place. Now, the coaster is moving smoothly in this area, but if you take a look this way, you get a beautiful view of the Pacific Ocean, and experts we talk to say that's part of the problem. But putting that Casa Romantica there 100 years ago on the edge of the cliff, yes. romantic as can be, yeah. to get that to last 100 years, they were incredibly lucky. Pat Abbott is a geologist and professor emeritus at San Diego State University. Pat says this is going to be a recurring problem. The tracks are here and you see the debris is almost down to it oh. and you see the, the the cliffs are still up there unstable. Yeah. I expect more to come down on those mm. cliffs. Thursday's landslide beneath part of the Casa Romantica Cultural Center in San Clemente sent dirt and debris down a hillside, leaving rail service shut down in the area and heavily damaging the center's concrete terrace. Pat says buttressing the area with concrete is a good start that doesn't last. But Mother Nature still does her work, whether it's a concrete wall or a concrete patio. Uh, erosion is still going on. If this sounds familiar, it is. These problems were supposedly just resolved less than five miles away as service returned between San Diego and LA earlier this month. More than $13 million went to stabilizing a different set of cliffs nearby and passenger trains were halted for months because of another landslide. Well, the last one was going to be two or three days and two or three days turned out to be six months. This time, Metrolink says the suspension of service is out of abundance of caution and will be reopened when it's safe. Amtrak says service between Irvine and San Diego will be temporarily suspended Friday, April 28th. Pat says it's not a matter of if for the next landslide, but when and rail companies, they need to get ready. It's a geologically unstable area and they need to get the train tracks out of there. That means this weekend there will be no service between L.A. and San Diego. If you had plans to travel this weekend, go to our website, CBS8.com, and click on this story for other accommodations. Kirsten Holmes, CBS8.